My intellect is without limit. Thanks back. School phase MTG. So I got another band champ, Miss Brew. I received such good feedback and a lot of people liked the first band champions deck I did with Calyx and Shark Typhoon, all that good stuff. Um, I happened to just stumble into building this deck, actually. Um, I was looking for cards that I hadn't really done much that are in standard right now. And I came across Enigmatic Incarnation. So in case you don't know what this is, it's a four drop enchantment. It says at the beginning of your end step, you may sacrifice another enchantment. If you do, search your library for a creature card with converted mana cost equal to one plus the sacrifice enchantment's mana, converted mana cost. Uh, put that card onto the battlefield and shuffle your library. Um, it's basically like a weird kind of birthing pod thing, but to sacrifice enchantments and fetch up creatures. Um, so yeah, it can be kind of difficult to build around because you got to get a good mix of enchantments and creatures to try to make it work. Um, but I think I did that. I think I got a good viable deck um, that's functional. And I actually do recommend this to play in rank. Um, I played this in rank. I only played it in rank, actually. Um, I played it in mythic rank. And um, out of 16 games, I won 11. So it's pretty pretty efficient and it's really, really good against low to the ground aggro and mid-range strategies that just want to just rush, rush, rush and try to get your life total down. Um, you gain so much life with this deck, you can pretty much outrace anything that's trying to just get you to zero life uh, as quickly as possible. So um, no problems racing with this deck. Um, let's get into the deck and then I'll explain how it works along the way. So we got... Uh, Two Arboreal Grazer, three Omen of the Sea, three Wolf Willow Haven, one Heliod Sun Crown, three Omen of the Sun, three Dryad of Elysian Grove, four Par Gift of Paradise, four Archon of Sun's Grace, uh, one Spark Double, one Thassa Deep Dwelling, one Arasta of in of the Endless Web. Um, I really like this card. I like I liked this card since it was spoiled, but I never really got to do much with it. Um, but it really works. It puts in work in this deck. Um, one Renata, Call to the Hunt, four Enigmatic Incarnation, two Cavalier of Dawn, two Elspeth of Conquest Death, one Urion, Sky Nomad, the infamous Urion. Um, and then for the land base, I got four Plains, one Castle Ventures, two Island, five Forests, two Hollow Fountain, one Temple of Enlightenment, two Temple Garden, one Temple of Plenty, two Breeding Pool, one Temple of Mystery, three Fable Passage. Then I got a sideboard built out for best of three, so we got... Four Mystic Subdual. That's strictly for going against Wyona decks because it has flash. You can flash it in on the Wyona and let them swing with their stuff and they won't be able to fetch up agents and steal none of your stuff because Wyona won't have any abilities. Uh, we got four Banishing Lights because why not? It's, it, it takes care of everything. Uh, one extra Arasta of, in, of the Endless Web. One extra Renata, Call to the Hunt. One Calyx um, to go against long grindy those long grindy decks you want to bring in your calyx he's card advantage he's extra removal he's good work against long grindy decks uh one extra cavalier don for some extra removal um same thing with elspeth conquers death and two tristani um for of course agents as we know so we got a kind of like a dual package going to try to combat agent we got the subduals and then we got tristani because we really don't want to be dying uh, losing to agent so let's get into how the deck works. So we have 11 three drop enchantments in this deck. Um, we have six two drop enchantments in this deck. So the two drops can fetch up uh, three drops and the three drops can fetch up four drops. Uh, basically, now picture this. On turn two, you play with a little Haven, all right? Then on turn three, you play Enigmatic Incarnation. End of your turn, trigger uh incarnation and you sack with uh with Willow haven and then you fetch up uh one of your dryad of elysian grove that's on turn three now you have uh your dryad in play he protects you against aggro and all those mid-range type strategies um he's good defense um but then on your next turn you can sacrifice him and fetch up an archon of sun's grace um, and then from there, you just start generating tokens. You start all these tokens, Pegasus with lifelink and evasion. Um, you get so far ahead of the game very, very quickly. Um, if you untap with your son's grace, you pretty much should win the game from there. Um, we have 11 three drop enchantments in here to help, help us fetch up Archon. 
So basically, we it, the deck feels like we're running eight copies of Archon because you don't have any problem getting Archon in. Even if they remove it, you have so many three drop enchantments that you can just fetch another one back up at the end of turn. Um, it gets really crazy because you fetch up Archon, you get Archon into play, you play a three drop enchantment with Enigma out, it triggers Archon, gets you tokens, then at the end of your turn, Enigma triggers, you sacrifice that three drop enchantment fetch up another Archon or one of your other four drop uh, creatures that just happen to be creatures and enchantments. We can always sacrifice these to fetch up uh, Cavalier Dawn if there's something out that we need to get rid of. Um, so does the deck, it feels smooth and it synergizes real well. Um, when you're going up against decks that are playing a lot of spells, you want to bring in your extra uh, Arasta and your extra Renata because getting two three spiders every time they cast a spell is it gets to be pretty devastating and then the, the tokens have the, the spider tokens have reached too so um they're going to have a hard time getting to you with evasion um you're pretty much just going to crush whatever it is that they're trying to do um this deck it like i said it feels smooth it plays smooth um you can outrace anything as you'll see from the gameplay i have no problem gaining life and like i said i do recommend this for rank um if you're going to play rank with it, I recommend best of three because the main board isn't built to combat um, fire as an agent. So I recommend playing best of three with it. Build the sideboard out. Play best of three with it. Don't go into best of one because you're just going to get you're going to get mad <laughs> going into best of one because those are where all the coin flip matches are. And once they get agent out, unless you want to integrate the sideboard into the main board, then go into best of one and play that way. Um, so that you're already prepared to go against fires and um, Wyona and any other kind of agent deck, I recommend this for best of three. But you can definitely rank up with this in best of three. But uh, yeah, enough talking about it. Let's get into the gameplay. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it. Hopefully, I'll pick up a third land so I don't get screwed here. Grandma from Iowa. Oh. I'm playing against somebody's grandma. It's exciting. Alright, um <clears throat> I'm gonna be nice to grandma. Okay, we gotta gotta land here. That's good. Man, I wonder how old she is. Is it like a young grandma or like one of those like a super super old old grandma? It's like 80 something. Oh man, hold on. I did I did that backwards. Because I'm sitting here talking about grandma. <laughs> I should have played Fable Passage first and then fetched and then and then played the uh forest. Hopefully I can hopefully I don't get screwed here. Maybe I pick up another land. If not, then okay. Alright, I'm good. I didn't get punished for the misplay on grandma. Put this on this. Oh, I got my three white for my cavalier. Man, what you gonna do, Grandma? Oh, Grandma's trying to get in for the damage. Grandma's trying to she's trying to put the spanking on me. Beat down, Granny. Beat down. Uh, okay, let me just go ahead and play Enigmatic. Fetch, fetch up my uh, my Archon, Sun's Grace. I think Granny's probably going to remove it. You got removal, Granny? You do, don't you? You going to remove my Pegasus? Oh man. Granny said no no Pegasus today. It's alright. I'll have to fetch up another. Gonna swing for three? Of course. Alright. Taking these taking these lickings here from Granny. Um no need to pay for this. Go ahead and play this. And uh fetch up another Another Pegasus. I'm 
Granny might, uh, Granny might say no again. Can I, can I have it, Granny? Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna get rid of my Enigma. Granny said, get that out of here. Alright, taking three again. Just take three. I guess I could have blocked it with my Pegasus, but... Oh well. I'm so used to just not even blocking <laughs> Knight of... Uh... Knight of Ebon Legion, that I, I just, it's just like second nature, you just don't even block it. <clears throat> Alright. Well, I'm gonna block this time. Because, can't pump. Uh, I'll block your other one with the spider. Kill the fly with the Cavalier. the spider back. I don't want to go all out on Granny. I want to I play nice for Granny. I want to be nice to Granny. I'm play conservative with Granny. I don't want I don't like being mean to grandmas. Boot nipper. Alright. I'll block the token that I gave you. Um, alright, let me go ahead and play, yeah, I'll play Omen. And, uh, just swing with the flyers. Don't want a boot nipper death touching any of my guys. <clears throat> Come on, Granny. Gary. Gary hit his sis granny. Alright, granny's all out of gas. Well, go ahead and play this and uh, swing in with the flyers. Alright, granny. You, uh, I'm gonna decline this. You got a chance to top deck something here. No, just the land. Alright. Go ahead and play my Urion. Uh, exile this and this. No, do I wanna... No, I don't wanna blow nothing up. I'm playing nice here for Granny. I don't, I don't wanna... Somebody's grandma here. I don't wanna be all... Crazy. Give her a chance here to maybe she'll talk, top deck something to make the game interesting. Have some comeback hope. No. Game's being mean to Granny. <clears throat> Alright, let me, uh, I'll block your boot nipper, block your vampire, uh, block Gary with the Cavalier. And, uh,. I think it's time to it's time to send the beats to Granny now. It's been fun, Granny. Play the grandma. Um, yeah, I'm gonna keep it so I, cause I can fetch up an island and uh. And I can play Omen so that can let me fetch up another land, hopefully. So I'm good with keeping two land here. Alright, fetch up island. Decimal. Uh-oh. Mono red. Stuff just got real. Mono red clock here. Go ahead and uh, 
get this out of the way. Oh uh, man, I really would like white, but um, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it because um, I don't know if I'm gonna. I don't know if I was gonna get into another land, so I'd rather have it in case I don't draw any more land, so that way I can uh, crack omen, possibly draw some more land. Lock your spitter here. I'll pump it. Of course. Why wouldn't you? Alright, that's good. Uh I got gotta pay for it. So go ahead and play enigmatic. I'm gonna fetch up a uh, dryad here. Increasing that clock. All right, he's paying for his street dodger there, so he doesn't have any more effects. That's good. All right, I can play. Uh, I can play my Pegasus now. Try it. All right. Start gaining some of this life back here. Uh, got no attacks. Uh, I want to get rid of him and get something better. Yeah. Yeah, I might as well. I might as well get another Pegasus. Yeah. Now I can play the spider and get two tokens. It's it's risky because I don't have any white mana, but I I need the life gain more than I need the white mana right now. <laughs> All right. All right. I thought about being greedy and playing a spark double on the arc for uh, targeting the Archon, but it's not. I don't want to stall out anymore. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to sack anything. Alright, I'm in a good position now. Got this under control. Oh, okay. That's fine. My spider gives me, gives me more spiders, though. Gives me more tokens. Alright, let's go ahead and play Nada. Nada. Obviously said name. Gain some life here. Decimal. Your chances of winning have decreased exponentially. <laughs> I don't uh, I don't foresee you winning this one. I don't think he foresees it either. You wanna scoop? You wanna scoop? Oh you wanna smack me with my own my own Pegasus? I'll take it. No reason not to. I wish he uh wish he had mana to put Embercleave on it. <laughs> Put Ember Cleave on my Pegasus. Alright. Just because uh, I'm gonna copy my spider. Just because the power of this deck. If it's left unchecked, you see what happens. Bye bye. Alright. Uh I think I'll throw that one back there. Um, keep this. You know, it's not it's not much better, but I don't I don't want to go down to five. And I'm on the draw, so all right, that's good. All right. Hopefully, I pick up the fourth land here. That's not a land, but come on, lot of reels. Fourth land. All right. In the game. Um. Uh, yeah, 
Uh, I guess I'll get planes. Uh, let's go ahead and get the Archon. Pegasus. Pegasi. Oh! Oh man. I guess he's not a fan of Pegasus. Alright. Oh! Land destruction. Hmm. Alright. Get my tokens in. So it's that kind of deck. Land destruction deck. Oh! Oh man! Oh man! That's all bad. I was already in a bad mana position from the start of the game. Wanna blow up another one? No? Alright, then I, then I top deck a Cavalier. Well, I'll just keep smacking you for two. Oh, no I won't! Man, Vanguard! Vanguard is on it! Blowing up my lands, blowing up my, my creatures. Alright, need that. Go ahead and put this, put this on my planes. Alright, smack you for one. Oh, I won't. Man! Vanguard! Alright, well, let me go ahead and play Enigmatic. Fetch up a uh, Pegasus here. Alright. Oh, you gonna remove him? Oh, man, what is, what is this? Is this deck just all like, removal and blow up lands? Are oh, you gonna blow up another land? Oh, man! Man, yeah, oops. <laughs> All right. All right, buddy. Don't go up another lane? No. All right. Go ahead and play this. All right. Uh, well, he doesn't have any cards in his hand, so go ahead and fetch up a uh, Pegasus here. If I draw a land, I can play the spider. Alright. Alright, Vanguard. You're in, you're in kind of a hole now. That's the, the problem when you're playing a... No, you decline. That's the problem when you're playing a deck that's just built to just... want to spot remove everything. Alright. Yeah, this is, this is great now. I'd say the hole has been climbed out of... You can uh you can put down the shovel now, Vanguard. No need in trying to keep digging. <laughs> um Fortunately I cannot keep this. No blue. Alright, much better. Keep this. I'll put back the Cavalier. Um yeah, I won't be casting him anytime soon. Fetch up a uh, planes here. Maxter, what you playing? What you got? Maxter, Maxter. Mono black? Maybe? We're running into a lot of mono black today. Oh. Rectos. Alright. Well, this deck is like. It's so efficient at gaining life um, that I can pretty much outrace any aggro strategy. So <laughs> I'm usually not even really worried about it. aggro strategies. Oh, another butcher. Man. Um. Uh, oh. Let me go ahead and catch up the land here. Up. Oh. I'm still not even worried, really worried about the butchers because the amount of life that I gain from this deck is just crazy. Matter of fact, you know what? I'm I'm not even gonna block the butchers. I'm gonna display the full power of this deck and its ability to gain life and race. 
I'm not gonna block the butchers this whole game. Just gonna attack with one. Alright, I don't really I don't really understand that, but <laughs> alright. Well, let me go ahead and I wanna play this first, because I, I wanna I wanna get the two tokens, so I'll take the I'll take the gamble. He, he might remove one and that could have just been a waste of turn, but I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it. Wanna swing in with your butchers? Why is he only attacking with that one? I don't I don't understand. Makes no sense to me. You swing with the other one, I block it, you kill my Pegasus, and you get the tokens for uh obsolete or whatever it is. Um go ahead and put this on a forest here. Play my spider. And let me swing in here and gain six life. I have no reason to block his butchers now. Cause his deck won't really wants them to die. So I'll just I'll just take the damage. I'm gonna outrace his damage. <laughs> now you want to swing with the the two two? All right. Well, I'll just take it all. There's uh, there's no reason for me to block anything. He may have some combat trick for his knight up there, so I don't care. I'll take it all. You're not gonna outrace me with damage, good sir. <laughs> Maxter. <laughs> That's, we're not worried about him either. He can't save you. Alright. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep that. Uh, go ahead and play faster. Get some more tokens. And uh, swing in with all the flyers. That's all she wrote, folks. No blue, so I can't keep it. Alright. I don't need that. Smokes. Smokes. It's a nice smoky looking swamp there. Alright, play tap. some black and green going on all right let me keep uh keep omen up here well he didn't pump before he swung but I'm still gonna flash my tokens in here and make him have to use his mana oh you're gonna you're gonna use it now wait <laughs> instead of waiting to see how I block all right I'll just use one token then A misplay on this part, but I like it. Kept him from advancing his board. Go ahead and play Dryad. Island. I'll keep my token on blocking duty. On oh, smokes. Oh, champion. All right, play my Pegasus. And uh, pass. You gonna be playing some enchantments too? The battle of the enchantments? Oh. Alright. Got the battle of the enchantments going on now. This match just got a little bit more interesting. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and play this and keep the mana up so I can use Omen to scry. Swing in with my Pegasus. Gain some life. Oh. Oh man. Um. Alright. Hmm. 
I guess I better. Well, no. Uh, I'm just gonna take the five because that that doesn't have trample, and I don't want to be taking eight. So I'm gonna take the five. Man, I guess I, I guess I better better get serious now. He's he ain't joking around. Uh, all right. I don't need this island. I'll keep the spark double so I can double up on my tokens. He might have removal, so if he removes my arc, my uh, my Pegasus, I'm in trouble. So yeah. All right. All right. Let me go ahead and get the aerial assault going now. All right. No cards left in my hand. Gotta make a run for it now. I gotta make a run for it, smokes. You gonna make your your Hydra fight my one of my Pegasus? Yeah. Man, I hope he can't remove both of them. Well, if he tries to remove the other one, then it'll his his Hydra will die, so. But then I'll still be uh, down my Pegasus. So that would be bad. That would be double bad. Bad for him, but worse for me. Alright, Smokes. What you doing? What you doing, man? Smoke. I don't think he's roping me. He might have a connection thing going on. Oh, okay. All right. Well, that really makes no difference. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna just gonna take five. You wanna swing with your swing with your hydra so I can kill it? Swing with it. I want you to. Please swing with it. <laughs> um yeah, just taking five. Alright. That's not the worst pickup. Could have been worse. Could have been a lane. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Uh, what do I want right now? Uh, uh I want Yurion right now. Yeah. All right, let me go ahead and swing first. Aerial assault. Got to do something about these flyer smoke. Get your uh, minus three, minus three off my druid. Yeah, I, don't, I don't need the grazing at all. All right, got this. Got this under control now. You ain't got no no answer, smoke. Got uh, all this aerial assault coming your way. You can swing at me with everything. I'll take it. Gonna swing. Swing with your your nine seven. Swing with it. I'll take it. I won't block. Come on, man. The rope is saying make a move. <laughs> make a move. Your move, man. Your move. Drinking my Yuri, huh? Still won't see. Oh! Oh no! Oh man! Oh no!
smoke, what did you do? Oh. Alright. Well. I got a Thassa. <laughs> oh, man. Man, smoke with the devastation. Oh, man. I'm in trouble. Let's see what I got here. Alright. Uh, I'll, I'll keep the spider. I'm gonna Elspeth Conquest Death his, his Hydra. And, uh, when the Pegasus comes back from Elspeth Conquest Death, I'll play the, play the spider. Alright. Gotta, gotta reestablish control here. Alright. Smoke put the smack down on my, my board. Good job, man. Good job. Oh, now he's getting stuff back. Smoke's going all in here. Alright. Alright. All, only thing I'm going to do is just tap his stuff down now. I'm going to hold the spider until the Pegasus comes back. stuff down here. Smoke is going all in on me. Alright, get my Pixis back. Alright, let's go ahead and play the spider. Take me the odd. And, uh, I'll flicker my spider. Get another token. Hopefully he doesn't play another... Master girl. If he does, I'm I'm tapped out. Got nothing. I got nothing, smoke. Nothing. What you got? Alright. Don't kill my Pegasus? I'm not gonna do it. You're gonna shrink it. Alright, well he won't be playing another Master Girl this turn, so. He's got to remove my flyer some kind of way. Maybe, uh, I don't know, what can he have? He can't, can't do Cry Canarium. Did he play a land yet? Uh, alright. Killing the Pegasus. That won't save you, though. Alright. Taking 10. Wanna swing with her, too? Oh. Yeah, I'm taking 10. Well, Smoke. You, uh, you put in some serious work there. But, uh, good game. Go ahead and tap your, your reach guy. And, uh, send in the air, the air squad. That's how you do it. You have it. Another sweet bat champ, Miss Brew. I hope you all liked it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay as always. Let me know what you think of the deck. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Please comment. Um, I'm running giveaways for this video, so make sure you comment. I'm always commenting to... Uh, I respond to comments of the, the winners of my giveaways in case people that are new subscribers to me don't know. So make sure you comment. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. All that good stuff. Um, the numbers are creeping up, so I'm getting closer and closer to a thousand. I will be giving away that that uh, collector's edition Icoria box once I hit a thousand subscribers. So I appreciate all the support. I appreciate everybody. Um, I appreciate everybody, the entire community. So um, please help continue help spreading the Scoop Phase Mania. I, I'm eternally grateful to all of you. I, I love to to do this and provide this content to you all. So um, yeah, enough of that. Enough of that mushy stuff. Um, Thanks for watching. See you all next time.